shit, shit. Keep moving. Keep moving. It's like its whole body is an open wound. We should keep moving. No telling how long that gate's gonna last. So tell me again why this was a good idea. Zombies in here. We gotta have food to share. There shouldn't be zombies inside the fences, right? Better question? Where are all the people? No way. They can't all be gone. They sure left a lot of stuff behind. This is just what I was hoping to find. No, really. I guess I just put me on the menu. Keep your eyes open. I bet you can find a better weapon here somewhere. Yo, dead come down. I better take a break. I need it. I was just thinking how much I needed that. Maybe my idea to explore the camp wasn't so good after all. Too many Z's behind us to go back now. You might as well keep looking around. That'll come in handy. Look at that. Even after this long, people kept hoping to find their families again. Yeah, just like Mom hoping you'd come home when she got sick. Didn't happen either. I had a job and a life. Unlike some people. Somebody had to take care of me. Sure wasn't gonna be you. I'm not getting into this again. Not now. Not often you find something this good. What is this place? Creepy as fuck. That's what. Locked. Looks just like the gooey one we saw outside the gate. And it bit me. I got gunk all over my shirt. Now that is a tragedy. No more wonder. I guess even a zombie apocalypse can't stop red tape. Shit, this bite is really itching. You always did fuss over every little scratch. Oh my god. What the hell happened here? Oh god. Oh, what a mess. Is it just me, or did it suddenly get really hot? Maybe we can find you some medicine if we keep looking.
Not often you find something that says useful, but it won't do anything for that fever. That'll come in handy. Yo, that's a lot of zombies. We can get past them if we're quiet. What are you two doing? Not supposed to be any civilians here. We thought the army might have food. Where did everyone go? Whoever's still in charge shut it down, pulled everybody out. The army's gone, kiddo. Lucky for you, I stuck around to keep an eye out for anyone left behind. Oh, fuck, I feel terrible. I just want to lay down and die. Hon, you don't look so good. My brother was bitten. I, I think it's infected. Got any medicine? I've seen this before. You need something special. Go find the doc over at the SMB. Tell him I sent you. Hey, there aren't supposed to be any civilians left in the camp. I always knew she was a softie. What do you need? My brother is sick. I think it might be serious. Uh-huh. Eh, you'd better come with me. This is like the one that bit me. What's wrong with it? We call it the blood plague. It's contagious to humans and it takes you while you're still alive. Are you saying that's what's gonna happen to me? Well, probably, but maybe not. Hey, you, come here. You have a flashlight. Look for a sample case in there and bring me whatever you find. I've been researching blood plague with some other civilians. We found a cure that works if you use it soon after infection. The army took our lab when they left, but they didn't get everything. Did you find it? No cure? Damn. I'll need an infirmary to culture a new dose. Hey, Doc, shit's getting bad out there. Thanks to all the noise, the Zeds are swarming the perimeter. This camp is done for. It's time for us to go. All of us. You know I can't leave Jamie. If you stay, I gotta stay. Then we both die. Jamie's gone. But this kid still needs your help. Okay, fine. Just... Give me a second. Make it quick. We don't have much time. Before we go, I need your help. That thing in the cage? It was a person once. I tried to reverse the effect, but we ran out of time. I don't have it in me to do what I should. Maybe you do? I'm sorry. I hope you're in a better place now. Listen, I know we've had our problems, but please, don't let me turn into one of those things. You're my brother. I have your back. 
always. Thank you. I'm sorry I wasn't stronger. All right, time to go. Big Sister's got the wheel. I heard some rumors about a good place we could pull up. So how do we survive without the army around? We keep going. As long as we stick together, we can survive anything. Sounds like we're empty again. You'd better be close. This is the place. Pull up here. It's not much, but it should keep us safe. Luckily, I don't need that much to get started. Good to know. How are you feeling, little brother? Like I got hit by a truck. This plague shit sucks. Yes, and you need to take it seriously. Get over to the infirmary, okay? <sighs> yeah, sure. The infirmary. Maybe that'll fix everything. Up. I feel like trash. Please tell me he's gonna pull through. He has to. This isn't as good as having the actual cure, but I should be able to keep his blood plague from getting worse for a while. That is, if we can keep our supply of meds from running out. Damn it, this isn't fair. Hey now, don't panic. The doc has this under control. I know how to make a cure that'll work. That's not the issue. I just need more plague samples. My lab didn't have enough. I think I saw a place where we can find all the samples you'll need. Let's hope I didn't imagine seeing that toolkit in the trunk. I better get some of this unloaded. It's locked up. Nothing kicking in here. Worthless.
Better than a slap in the face. Well, that's pretty heavy. I gotta catch my breath. Down to the last one. No more of that. Time to get this done. Ain't nobody dying on my watch. I found the plague sample we need. Nice work. We're one step closer to the cure my patient here. your sample here. How's he doing? I'm starting to think dying would be better than this. Relax. Everything will be fine. And you, please drop the sample in our supply lock. We now have enough plate samples to make the cure. We should get on that as soon as possible. Alrighty, I have the cure in hand. You ready to start feeling better? Not to stress you out or anything, but I'm still kind of dying here. Don't worry. We've got the cure. You're gonna be fine. Thank you. Thank you. And now that I'm not dying, I... I'd forgotten how it felt to actually save a life instead of losing all the time. I like that feeling. I think maybe survival is just finding every chance to feel like that again.
fix the worst of the damage. That'll have to do for now. The pipes are working and the breaker box is connected. Enjoy your water and power, everyone. I'm filling up the tank now, but it won't last that long. We gotta find some place with more fuel to scavenge. Time to go for a spin. Just gotta make sure those repairs worked. All right, we survived. That's good. But we ain't the only ones out here trying to do that. Unless we start killing some uglies, nobody's gonna last in this town for long. In my experience, the best way to find uglies is to follow the screamers. I saw one on our way into town. Okay, it's working fine. That's a relief. I'd hate to be stuck walking all the time. Driving is faster, safer, and lets me bring back a lot more supplies. We should worry about our base before we go out hunting Zeds. For this place to be functional, we need to upgrade it with some building materials. Seems like this situation has gone from bad to worse. Uh, this feels dangerous. Remind me why we're doing it? We gotta clear out this infestation before it gets worse. Okay, scratch one infestation off the list. It's just a start, but it shows we could do this. the new outpost all set up. But honestly, I see how a bit more work might be If we're thinking about long-term survival, we need friends. Let's get on the radio and see who else lives around here. Yep, nothing more to see here. Pretty heavy. I need something I can drive out of here. Help me out. We'll put someone on that.
It's locked up. Kicking in here. Don't this beat up. That's it for those. That's it. Okay, I've seen what there is to see.
search this place for materials. I like the effort, but is this really our top priority? This is about our home. That has to be our priority. A whole lot of nothing here. We got a new outpost ready for business. That said, I think it'd be worth spending some time improving it. It's locked up. Looks like they're cleared out.
I'm home. Did y'all keep out of trouble? I'm glad you're home. Thanks for handling this. this job start we can use those materials to start building anytime if we built a workshop we could keep our weapons from falling apart I know weapon maintenance isn't sexy but it keeps us alive it's really about being self-sufficient that's critical out here you always brighten my day The way for us to survive is by heading off potential conflicts before they even get started. If we claimed the nearby military site as an outpost, that would warn away any potential troublemakers. And it'd also give us a steady supply of ammo in case anybody doesn't get the message. Show my ass to a bunch. Now that's gonna make things nicer around here. We can't keep this place in good shape without materials. Take it easy. Can't let this get the better of me. I'm not super happy about this aggressive plan of ours. I get what you're saying, but I don't see that we have a choice. Yo, this is bad. I see a bunch of dead army guys walking around here. They're probably wearing bulletproof helmets. Handheld weapons are a better choice here. Relax, I got this.
No more zombies over here. Can you get an outpost set up there? People need to know this is our territory. Huh. Nothing but good times. All done here. The air smells awful here. It's gotta be a plague heart. And that means plague zombies too. Whoa, a lot of plague zombies around here.
Special delivery. This place looks like a waste of time. I'm right as rain and ready to get back out there.
I think that'll do it. clear. This will make a great outpost. But good time. Yo, this is your new neighbor, reaching out to say hello. Hit me back if you're up for a little meet and greet. It's a relief to hear another voice. We're in a bit of a bind and could use some help. Can you come by? Ah, you see? We just got here, and we're already making friends. Come on, let's go say hi.
So this is where all the plague zombies hang out. Huh. Wonderful. Am I the only one who thinks this might be crazy? They need help. I think we gotta do this. I don't think so. Oh shit, someone needs a hand. <gasps> much. We're seeing a lot more plague zets lately. I tell you, it's that new plague heart growing nearby. I'm sorry to ask a favor so soon, but our food supply is spoiled. Do you have any extra? We'd really appreciate that. Our neighbors are out of food. It looks bad, guys. Don't we have enough in our storage to share a bit? If not, we should go out and scavenge for more. This place looks empty. Man, our neighbors are gonna be stoked to see this food. Well then, moving on. Can't find the things. You really came through for us. I guess we owe it. 
Glad to help. We took a risk, reaching out to strangers like we did. But making connections like that, I think it's how we rebuild the world. Hey, how's it going? I'm hoping to make a trade. Interested? Yeah, that sounds about right. Post is done. We don't know for sure if plague sets are created by the heart or just attracted to it. But if we leave this one alone, it's only a matter of time before one of us catches blood plague. Uh-huh. I hear you, loud and clear. Should be enough to seriously mess up that plague heart. 